We are all packed up and ready to go to our next camping spot, which is free, 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 free. This is Joe Skiing Campground. We love it. And if we ever come back, hopefully we can get number five again. <laughs> we are out. Yeah. A couple of people came in um, since we been here. You ready, baby? Rolling out. <sighs> like those pull behind trailers right there they came in the night two nights ago and, and late night and then switched to this spot because it's a huge spot so if you got a a big group just go around and look for the big spot which ones okay Cassandra too that we just passed with the biggest spots <laughs> people right there they came in a couple of nights ago then their friends came in last night this right here when well, we just passed it a pull through that was number nine number 10 is a pull through that's pretty huge they've been in here since we got here and all they have is 10 spots you know i've never seen a vehicle hooked to that since we got here cake was saying looked like the big group was gone there was a group at least I would say 15 and they had kids and they was having a good time and good thing is they really didn't disturb us at all they, they were in that site right there which is number two and there's the second porta potty restroom and this guy been here since we were gone I mean since we arrived And that's number one that he was at. So we are headed out. Attempting to find our next camping location. And to my left, way up there, maybe the host location because it looked like they have electric here. But we haven't seen a host in this campground since we've been here on this particular spot. Goodness. It's why we ride for real, huh? Oh my lord. Copy that. now wow it do feel like we in in utah but we not but all the areas the same all right what dad will say well present the app for them center in my arch where i want to see the arch two Where? Oh yeah, that's it. So I'm gonna read the gate and see how that hike is because everybody putting their hiking shoes on and they shorts and we in boots and jeans. Okay, 
copy that. Oh, I just see him. Yeah, it looks like they got a pretty flat trail. Almost look like El Moro to tell you the truth. I'll be there. I'll be there. Oh, I see the pregnant shelter thing. All right, ranger station, water up, and then find us a spot for the night. The what? Oh, no. Not happy? to the left now we can see it better Arizona about to go visit Horseshoe Bend. Man, did we get some special parking? We got special, special motorcycle parking. Got our electric lights, two full water bottles, plus our big giant bottles with ice water in it, in case we blown out by the time we come back. I don't know how far the hike is to it, but it is early in the morning and the weather is pleasant in the middle. Uh, if you guys seen our video from when we was in Page, Arizona, I think it was two years ago. Yes. Way over there is Glen Canyon, which well, this is part of Glen Canyon Recreation Area also, but that's where we were way over there. Way over there somewhere. <laughs> and we didn't realize how close we were to this. So now we're going to check this out. Once again, everybody need hiking shoes and shorts and slippers and good, uh, but come I guess up you could say, hair. hiking gear. Look. <laughs> and look what Cake and I are in. <laughs> Boots and jeans. Now you know why we name our channel Boots and Jeans Riders. I mean, we could easily take our boots off and put our walking shoes on, but sometimes not even worth it when we're not going that far. So, oh, one thing we forgot for motorcyclists, it's five dollars to get in. I don't remember what it said for cars and all that type stuff. But we're on a motorcycle. Now I don't know why they charge, but rumor has it that this is part of Glen Canyon Rec National Recreation Area as well as the city of Page. So rumor has it, I don't know how true it is, that the city of Page is the one who started charging people and they put the entry boot up. How long has it been up? I have no idea. Me either. This is our first time here. From the looks of it, definitely won't be the last. You know, some people say, once you've seen one place, you don't really have to go back. That's true. There would not be so many return visitors to the Grand Canyon. As you grow older and you start to see nature and the beauty of the world, then sometimes you want to visit things twice. Now, we've been around the world a couple of times. Aye, and, aye, aye. I know. And we're talking about going back to places, and we've never been back to the same place twice. No. Because. We like well there's too much to see to go back the world is so big same. yeah why go back to the same place twice we've been in the same area a couple of times yeah. australia new zealand um uh, what's that one there that fiji. we really love fiji yeah that south pacific we've been there several times but outside of that you know that's so much on this planet and you go back to the same place over and over again like back how you doing good morning 
you go back to the same place over and over again when you could be discovering, exploring something new. All right, we oh, finally it, made it. it. Let's go see what this is all about. If it worked, the walk, and based on what I'm seeing, oh yeah, let me turn this camera around. Oh my goodness. Kind of dizzying, but we're not afraid of heights, so no big deal. Look at this, people. Look at that. Wow. What you think, babe? This, wow. This is amazing. Okay. To see it in person. I'm going to express it a little better than cake. Wow. <laughs> this is amazing to see it in person. Look at that. Look at that. This is nice. This is... Look at the boat down there. I wonder if it's catching it. Okay, we're going to go from a different angle and see. And also, look. There are, there are parts you can go sit on the edge and be relatively safe. But right here, there are rails for a reason. Like the guy in... What park was it where he fell and died? Yosemite. Oh, they no, have... It wasn't Yosemite. Grand Canyon. Yeah, Grand guy, Canyon. Grand guy Canyon. went over the rail just to take a picture and whoever was recording it was saying, I hope he's going to not fall and he wound up falling and dying. So when you're in a spot where there's a rail, you use it. But this is very, very impressive. Best time is early in the morning. Otherwise, you're going to melt like a snowman. You got no... I had to come see the edge of this. There it is. Now, I'm not getting too close to the cliff. I just want to show you. Look at that. That's the, that's the cliff right here. And then down on the other side, what you're seeing is where the island is. Walk a little bit further. See, can I catch some of this? Wow. Okay. This is the closest I dare to get without a railing. I know I can get a little closer, but what if a gust of wind come? I love life. There it is. Finally caught back up with Cake. Standing on the edge. Life is meant to be lived. Okay, too well for fun. This quote I got from you in this life live this life whoa oh look at you on the edge and didn't want to come where i went rich has finally caught back up to me he that over there scary. seeing That's what scary. i see that is scary it's scary yeah. how scary is it enough to where i'm gonna keep my legs spread like this <laughs> No, hike in this area. And when you come to visit it, to be a short visit, take us around the other side. She already came to this section. So I had to come see what she see. And I just had to sit down and take it all in. What an amazing, beautiful country we have here. Okay, can you hear me? I don't want to yell too loud because I don't want her to think something's wrong with me. But I know she's on the other side of this curve. Well, she probably just texts me. Uh, some tax people I'm not interested in. But this is why we ride. Goddamn ride, right, people. Live your life to the fullest. We got the sun and the moon and this huge canyon right here, Horseshoe Bend. Love it. <laughs>